this morning, the real circus came in. Chinese New Year Eve today, I have so many things to do, so many dramatic things happening. Especially when your college kid came home, try to help you cook, join the circus. And I got a little warning when I tried to just get a fish in Asian market today. I was making eight dishes today, but the most scary moment in my life is when my husband asked me this. Did you make rice? I was frozen when I heard this. You're gonna find out what happened next. Okay, start back to the bed. Good morning. No, my circus is a real circus. I have an animal here. I have two other members. Let's get them up. Let's see what the other two kids do. Oh, the computer, you're fast. Where are your sisters? Let's see if the girls are up. Of course, in the weekend, they get up early to play games, and during the week, they cannot get up for school. Next, my college kid, I have to wake her up. Oh, it's Asian mom, special way. This is Chinese mom's way to wake up your kid. Really works. Let's go. Chinese New Year decorations. We're making big dinner today. And hong bao. Otherwise, no hong bao for you. No <gasps> hong bao. Okay. Okay. <laughs> New Year is a big holiday, so I always tell my parents, my grandparents, I am making money. I'm going to get a lot of 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 money. <laughs> okay, get up. Also, we've got these Chunlian we put on the door decoration. And the golden coins. Those are my favorite ones when I was little. It's chocolate, but not real chocolate, you know. It's a, like a fake chocolate, but I'm sure now it's better chocolate. That's a lucky number, do you know? So you have good luck this year. For you. Can, can you say Hong Bao Na? Uh, 恭喜发财, 说一个, 说恭喜发财, 说恭喜发财, okay. Okay, let's, let's see. Okay, 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 Wait, I got s oh yeah six. Ah! I have sixteen, but lucky um, number. I have lots of ones though. Okay, 你看我问姐姐有多少? Chinese New Year. Oh, I want to eat one. 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 Oh,
young people out there. 小心。出入平安。Okay, this is the 横联。Sparkly. 恭喜发财，大吉大利，出入平安。祝大家新年快乐。Let's get some makeup on. We're gonna go cooking. 门帘要不要看一下？哦，哦 ，Yes, this is my seventeen-year-old pickle brand. People always ask me, what do you use this for? Eat pickles. Yeah, the side dish, eating with rice, or I use my pickles a lot for cooking, especially the pickled pepper. Today I'm gonna use for the fish, for this chicken spicy chicken dish, cold dish. Sichuan pickles, not just for eating. A lot of this is for cooking too. Pickled pepper and pickled radish. You can make a sour pickled radish soup. So you take the old pickles out every time before you pickle your new vegetables. So keep the brain healthy. First, I start making my pickles. This will be ready by the dinner time tonight because my pickle brain is so strong. Yes, seventeen year old, older than you. After seal the jar with water, I put her back in her comfortable place. You have to have chicken soup for Chinese New Year, and you need a whole chicken with head and feet. And this silken chicken is a black skin. It's really a lot of nutrition here, and with really simple ingredients. This ginkgo nuts chicken herbal soup is one of my favorite chicken soup. Ginkgo nuts brings back memories of me and my grandpa picking out、uh, fresh ginkgo nuts for off the tree in front of our apartment. Those taste so good. Those are still in the nut shell. So me and my grandpa, we will peel each of them, and he will make me a plate of a stir fry with vegetable or soup. So good. This soup gonna sit on the stove for a few hours. So I'm start chopping the ribs. I'm making steamed ribs、uh, with sweet potatoes. Chinese food is just a lot of preparation, chopping, peeling, and washing the vegetable. After this, it's really quick. So today, my daughter is helping me, so it should be much faster. Chopping this、uh, green onions, ginger, and Sichuan peppercorn, one of my favorite ingredients. Then we marinate the ribs with all these ingredients on the side for 30 minutes. You know me, I always hold bottles, measure with my Chinese eyeballs, just like my grandma. Measuring spoons. This wasn't available. Practice with me, you'll be like me. After you got my Chinese eyeballs, you can just use any tools to put any seasoning in your food, and just give a massage. Get all the ingredients in the ribs. I only give massage to the meat, not my husband. But he get to eat this. I think he's making、uh, steam buns upstairs, so he's、uh, pretty helpful. This is a seasoned rice powder you add in the ribs. You can make on your own, grind the rice, mix with spice, or you can buy it from the Asian market. The rib is chilling in the fridge, and next I'm taking out two containers. Those are the rib braising sauce. You can save it, freeze it, use it next time, over and over. These sauce, master sauce. I defrost them, so they're making a beef dish in here. Asian market. Cookbook recipe in my book. Link down description. Get my book now. Just a little bit of ice in here. Support the master sauce in the pot. The second one. There are so many things I need to cook at the same time. So the stove here is very small, so I have to set up a little stove on the counter. But all this time, I was wondering why Wendy's still not ready to come out help me. So I decided to just go over, open her door, see what she's doing there. Oh, hey, Mama! Ah, yeah, I saw you already. Hello, Ma. Hello, hello. This for cooking? Oh, too fancy for cooking, I think. Let's come, help me. Chop the sweet potato. Slice. Don't chop your. What's that? Okay, how 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 thick? How thick? You don't dress like you're gonna cook. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So scary. This is too small. What's this? Huh? Cutting half. I should chop like this. All right. So like this big. Let's check. Okay. I chop this one for right. Oh, two hands. Okay. Put this on the bottom of the steamer. Oh, my master sauce is boiling. Look at that. I thought this was a pin. 
就这样嘛，<笑>三一面 flip over this. So peel this, okay? So peel and chop like just like that one. You need some practice. Peel. Yeah. Yeah. Your great grandma used to peel this with a cleaver, just this. See, we didn't have a peeler that time. Peel like a grandma. Your great grandma. Look. At. Uh. What, yeah. What? What is this? This is pumpkin. <laughs> Sweet potato. Hongshu. Dao bang da da lo. Aiyo. Want to kill me? Want to murder me? She laughing off often on the floor. Why so funny? <laughs> so now we put the ribs on the sweet potato evenly. I'm gonna check the water. Soup. See, I have so many dishes to make. Like everybody's hungry. I don't know if I can finish on time. Now water's boiling. This rib dish is ready on the steamer. You can see me have four burners. Going at the same time. Okay. Mm. Here's the tea bag uh, for the master sauce. Every time you use, I just add some more spices in here. What's the other thing? You find it easy, This is so big, you know. You just don't put it in the bag, or you gotta break it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> mm. Maybe two pieces of bay leaves. 拉紧口袋，卤牛肉，嗯，哦、oh. ，嚼一嚼，嚼一嚼，拿来。So you need some green onions and ginger. In the master sauce, I'm slowly braising the beef. You can reuse the sauce for any of the protein you like. Chicken soup is boiling. Look at the color. Yellow color. That's what you need. Study another new pot with ginger, green onions, and shrimp pepper corn. I'm boiling some chicken thigh for this cold shui ji, this cold dish. After boil the chicken all cooked, we put in the cold water, set on the side, let it cool, then we prepare in the sauce. This spicy sauce is use my pickled pepper, some garlic, and chicken powder, some sugar to balance the taste. Also, of course, you need the soy sauce and vinegar. Topping with green onions. Also add the homemade chili oil and my Sichuan peppercorn oil. There's one more thing you need to add in the sauce. You take some of that chicken soup. You boil the chicken thigh into the sauce. Then chop the chicken. Now your finger pour over the sauce. This sauce is actually good with bamboo or any vegetable or any protein you like. And next, pay attention. I grab this pork belly from Asian market. The shape, the shape of the pork belly. That's the only thing they have in the market. But the shape made me、uh, trouble. To me, this dish is like a dessert. My grandma's recipe. Every New Year, sweet pork belly called 甜烧白 sprinkled with some sugar.、Oh, so good. And there's a filling, red bean paste. So we boil the pork first, then we steam it. And the sticky rice has soaked overnight. At least you have to soak it for three hours. And the pork belly just melt in your mouth. Melt it. So soft. Shrimp pepper corn. Cook it about 80% cooked. Cooking wine. The sweet pork dish. I use a sweet rice, a sticky rice. We have to steam it first. Make it half cooked in the steamer. So the pork is still a little bit. Pink inside when you boil is not fully cooked. After boiling,、uh, here's my trouble. So you see the pork belly is very thin. The pork belly is too flat, too thin. So I have to slice sideways.、Uh, my grandma's way is to slice them vertically. You can get really thin slice. So that was my trouble. I need to get like a big square piece of big pork belly so I can slice them vertically. Get really nice thin pieces.、Uh, my pieces is a little thick. But I make it work. I put the red bean paste in the fridge, so now it's kind of solid. So I can chop in a little long piece, put it inside the pork belly, fold it like a little dumpling. The two piece of pork belly is connected in the bottom. So inside, you create this little pocket for the red bean paste. Then light them up in a bowl. Look, start looking like a pork dessert. What do you guys think? Vegetable oil in the wok. I add brown sugar, make this、uh, syrup type sauce.
for the meat and the rice. Careful, a little cool, a little. Don't add water in the hot oil. Be careful. After cook for about 15 minutes, you see this brown syrup type consistency with bubbles. Next, I put a half cooked sticky rice in a bowl. Add the brown sugar syrup. Mix very well. Then we are going to add this、uh, secret ingredient, my lard. Look at how white it is. Down the description, there's a video how to make your own lard at home. Oh, this texture and the shiny. Add the syrup on the pork. Then we pour over the sticky rice. Cover the pork. Press, press, press. Make it tight because later we're gonna flip over. Put the pork and the sweet rice in the steamer. We are going to steam on a high heat until so soft and flip over. Now my ribs and sweet potato is all cooked. Sprinkle some green onions to finish up. Oh, cooking all them almost there, almost fish. You have to have fish for Chinese New Year. See, there's my fish. Asian market.、Uh, I pointed to that fish. The guy told me something. I thought he told me to go the other counter to buy the fish, but. Turns out is this. Ah!、Huh? Oh. But eventually, he let me just、uh, film my fish, not everybody else. I guess. Oh oh oh! We're running away. Oh. He actually got my fish. Oh, oh, oh this one, my fish. <laughs> Fresh always better. My doggy's here. Pepper's here. His name is Pepper because you know me. I love pepper. Pepper, pepper, fish and pepper. <laughs> yeah. This fish dish is called dou ban yu. It's a very classic Sichuan dish. I start with some cooking oil, sprinkle some salt because this way your fish won't stick on the bottom of your wok. Stir fry the fish until golden brown. Then we take it out. Stir fry ginger and garlic. Also chop my pickled peppers. Get the fragrance out. Next, keep fragrant your green onions. And the shrimp pepper corn. Also scoop out pi xian dou ban. That's what the name from dou ban yu. This is a Sichuan broad bean paste. After you see red oil from the dou ban, add chicken soup. Get the spicy bath ready for the fish. Fish now jump in. Then we braise the fish in the spicy sauce. Also, I add some soy sauce, a little sugar to balance the taste. Let the fish soak all the fragrance and the flavor. I can just smell this through the screen. Don't you? Sprinkle some green onions. We are ready to serve on the Chinese dinner table. I don't have a round table. I hate this. I need a big round table for Chinese dinner. No individual portions. Old family style sharing dinner. Beef from master sauce. I'll slice them. Circus is coming, or just you? Not yet. Cooking bowl. Husband's here. Did you make rice? I respect the youth. We have a Chinese dinner, no rice. I mean, bun. No. How can we not have rice? Oh, no rice, no dinner. The rice is a sticky rice with the pork in it. The beef will breathe in the master sauce. You will serve as a cold dish in the beginning. Also, this is so good with beer. Don't forget pour over some little master sauce on the top of the beef. And get some chili powder in the middle. You feel like spicy? Just dip in. Chicken soup. You did the last dish you put on the table. But tonight we're just gonna put everything on the table. Serve every dish. I usually put a little bit of salt in the end. I don't cook salt in the chicken soup. A traditional, authentic Sichuan dinner always come with pickles. So tonight, I have to serve my pickle as a side dish. Circus is here. Jian, 把这个泡菜拿过去，放过去啊，好好好。Last dish, I have to put on the plate. I can't even pick it up. Some juice come out. Let's see. Wow. How's that? 甜烧白
Oh, I know. The last touch. You take it. The food, sir. Oh. Okay, you have. What do you want, Cindy? Uh, you want, you want some meat, bun? You want a bun? Yeah, bun. First, Chinese New Year for What's his name? <laughs> yeah. So that's a sweet dish. I think only the fish you can eat. Otherwise, ribs, beef, you want a bun? pickles, and that's chicken. We can put the chicken. What do you want? We can put the chicken here. Yeah. That chicken. Okay. Maybe move it here. Yeah. Down here. Where? Pepper's down there. Oh, okay. Like spicy, you can dip the uh, chili powder, or you can just eat like this. This year's the year of rabbit. And uh, if you are born the year of a rabbit, you have to wear something red. Or red belt, red clothes, red underwear. To avoid the bad luck. No me. Sticky rice. Mm. Pickle anyone? Amazing. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Okay, use these two. Pepper is staring at all the food. Huh? Oscar, not eating. What do you mean? We gave you chops. She didn't use them. You're just saying that. You shouldn't use them. He's waiting for chopsticks? Oh. Uh. Mm -hmm. Salty and sweet. That's sticky. And crunchy. It's not crunchy. I use my Chinese. Hello, this one is for you. My meat is older than you. Not crunchy. Soft and sweet. <laughs> this dish really remind me of Chinese New Year. My grandma made it every year. Grandma is older than you. <laughs> grandma. Yeah. Good luck. Good fortune. And uh, wear red. Wearing red. In underwear. And find love. And cook more. Chinese food. Okay,